Jesus told him, I'm the way, the truth, and the life. No one can come to the Father except through me. John 14, 6. Alright you guys, so before we get this video started, I just want to show you guys my boyfriend's hair. This was last year in March. He used to have dreads, but because of his hair texture, he couldn't really keep the dreads. So this is what they looked like before. And then I took them out, and this is what it looks like. So his sides were tapered, but it started to look kind of like a mohawk. So it was really curly, and that's how he wore it for a long time. But I think he just kind of got lazy, and taking care of it became a little too much for him. So, um, as you can see right here, you know, it's just dry looking. So I finally convinced him to cut his hair. And now currently he's growing it back out. And, you know, this time around, maybe he can learn how to take care of it a little bit better. So this is where we are now. So let's just get this video started. Hey everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Shakela. If you're new and in today's video, my boyfriend, Shaq. Shaq. Okay, <laughs> he's gonna be showing you guys how he does his wash day routine for his 3A, 4A, 4A, 4A. hair. So be sure you guys Let's like this video and subscribe and make sure you hit that little bell icon so you're always notified whenever we post a new video. We she posts a new video. Okay, let's just get started. <laughs> So as you can see, right here, we go on to step number one, which is just me rinsing my hair. I do this for about a minute. Now moving on to step two, I put a quarter size amount of shampoo and then just lather it in my hands and then just rub it in my hair. And I claw at my hair in small circles to really activate the curls. And I do this twice. And as you guys can see, the second time I do it, I'm getting a lot more bubbles. This means my hair is now clean and that's what um, causes more suds. It's a little science lesson. You're literally so tall. Why is your head next to the freaking <laughs> nozzle? Yeah. So I'm like getting so scared that you're gonna like hit yourself. Also make sure when you're rinsing your hair out, you continue to make those small circles with your fingers just to keep those curls. And step number four, it's time to condition. We're gonna put a Pringle-sized amount of conditioner in our hand, rub it together, and I like to start on the sides because my sides don't get as curly as the top, and once I massage it into the sides, I slowly start bringing it into the top, really just clawing at my head, vigorously, but gently.
And as you can see, my lips are moving because I'm actually singing the song American Pie because it's seven minutes and 38 seconds long. And I usually listen to that song while I do my conditioning stage because I just condition my hair for seven minutes and yes, that's it. Now, as you can see, I'm just continuing to massage the conditioner out of my hair and cue sexy head turn. Oh yeah. And then we wash it out from the front. And step number four is now done. If you're following along, you should now be getting out the shower as I am. And now, since we're out of the shower, this is where I dry my hair. I'll just do it, tap a towel on. How easy is that? Bob's your uncle. Take it off. Hair's just a little bit damp now. And then we go on with the wild growth. Now, with the wild growth, I use this first because it's not a moisturizer. It's not used to keep your hair um, moisturized. I use it, obviously, to grow my hair as well as to have a good just base and foundation for my scalp and to have it nice because my scalp tends to get a bit dry. So we just rub that in with our fingertips and then we'll move on to the next step. And step number 13, we're moving into our Shea Moisture Leave-In Conditioner uh, step. And what I'm going to do is just get a little Shea Moisture and rub it into the sides of my head. Because as I said earlier, the sides of my head are the last to get the curls. So I put more conditioner in there to activate the curls more on the sides. Then we get a little bit more and we put it on the top. And we just massage that in there in the same way that we were when we were washing our hair. Now, if you're like me and you wear glasses, don't be afraid to put them on and take a look in the mirror. Because sometimes I don't have them on for the whole time. And I realize when I put them on, I can see the curls a little bit more defined. So, it's just a little tip if their curls aren't looking as good as you want them to look. Now what I'm doing is I'm going to get a gummy worm amount of um, Pantene leave-in conditioner and I'm just going to lather that into my hands and rub it into my whole head with spider fingers. Got to make sure you do the spider fingers and just continue to rub it through your hair. The spider fingers is what creates curls. And then you just keep spinning and spinning and spinning and spinning and spinning. That's what it's all about. And sometimes I like to take my fingers and just do little curls to maybe create some curls where they won't grow naturally. So I just do that with my fingers, just activating the curls manually. <laughs> That's a little life hack for you guys. And step number 27, what I'm doing is I'm just finalizing it you know just shaping it out so it's nice and round and i think we're looking pretty good i think we're looking pretty good as we move into the home stretch and thanks for watching 
and there you have it uh this is the final look and y'all i am not no hair professional this is just my own thing that i did uh so take everything I say with a grain of salt. This is just what works for me. Do whatever works for you. Hey, oh. <laughs> wait, pat your head down in the middle. You see that curl like right at the top towards your forehead? No, towards, no. yeah, okay. Thanks for watching. Make sure if you want to see more. Why are you bending down, babe? Because the camera's low. Okay, well, I'll bring it up. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for watching. If you want to see more hair videos, subscribe to Jaquela Caprice. And if you want to see more of me, follow me on Instagram at Shaq's Arts. You got conditioner all in your ear. All right, you guys. Thanks for watching. Bye.